Hi there, my name is Pamela. I'm the founder of the petadorn.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to measure your dog in terms of making your own uh, dog t-shirt cutting pad. Belle, she's a female dog, so I measure four things for her. The neck. The lens. The lens part, uh, I always suggest that people have the collar on. So when you have the collar on, and then starting from the collar, and measuring down to her tail, to the base of the, her tail. Uh, it makes a difference when the dog's in the sitting position, or laying down. The measurement could be just one to two inches uh, difference. But if it's sitting up, and it's probably, you're going to be a little bit shorter. So if you do that, which is okay, you just add additional inch or two or inch and a half in addition to the measuring. The girls. I added one thing for both male and female dog is the space right here in between the legs. <laughs> okay, this is to give you to determine how narrow your chest, ventral side of the dog. And if your dog is a male, I added one more thing, which is the fifth thing, from the neck down to the unit. And please make sure, um, have you, when you have a collar on, remember going down from, from the front side and going down. You want to make sure the maximum coverage, but you, know, you don't want dog to pee on the shirt, okay? So that's the fifth uh, part of the measurements for it. That's using 12 inches for this video since my dog model Shih Tzu Bell, she's 12 inches from the neck down and so I did 12 inches, roughly about 12 inches and then I add additional, you can see right here, it's about 2 inches, you can do about 2 and a half depending on the breed of the dog because each dog is different. This is another portion that I did. Um, this is for the, the neck, her neck at the ventral side or the chest part. And this portion connects here. Um, the reason I'm doing the half panel is because it is symmetrical. And that's why I just did the half. You can do the whole panel if you like. For this portion, this part, this is for the back, for the neck portion. And this is for the shoulder. And this gives you a little nicely curve, okay? As for this portion, this is for the sewing for it. Okay, and I can show you the finished portion. This is the finished dog t-shirt. Right here. This is symmetrical. And for this portion, this is the neck and this portion, okay? And once you connect, and it'll be this part. Okay, so this is the neck. Remember, the critical part when you're doing the cutting panel, just make a note of it, please. This portion should be the same length as this portion, so you can connect them together. And that's the dog t-shirt. So that's very simple, isn't it? 